All right, today I would like to teach you how to insert a table of contents into your wiki space. Um, if you notice, I created a custom one um, for my wiki space right here um, using CSS. That's probably <laughs> a tutorial for another time. But um, really cool feature in wiki spaces. Uh, what it allows you to do is if you have a lot of um, information on a page um, it's helpful to create a table of contents so that users can click on a certain topic and then it'll bring them down to that section of the of the page so they don't have to scroll all the way down so instead of scrolling doing all this they can simply do this and it jumps down or this so um, in order to do that, it's really simple. Uh, it actually involves a little bit of wiki text, um, which is just the code that wikispaces.com has provided for its users. So to do that, you go ahead and click on Edit. And then you can go ahead and click on Text Editor right here. Now, if you notice, I have this piece of wiki text at the very top of the uh, text edit section and all it is is two left brackets and then TOC and then uh, two right brackets so if I just erase it and type it out again T for table O for of C for contents two right brackets it's that simple. Um, you have to place it um, above everything else on its own separate line and then all of your other um, information on your page should go beneath it. Now here's here's one point that you you need to listen to closely. In order to um, actually get some sections into your table of contents you have to create some headings. So in order to do that I went ahead and decided to use um, wiki text for this as well. Um, you don't have to, but I just find that using the text editor is a little bit easier and less buggy um, for my computer, my browser. Um, so all you need to do to do this is whatever section you want to create and that you want to show up in the ta table of contents, just type in two equal signs before the phrase or the word and then two equal signs afterward. If you do that it'll automatically show up in your table of contents and you'll be ready to go. So that's it. That's just uh, one way to create a really uh, helpful table of contents for, for your users.